Hey mates, in this video we are going to set up environment on Ubuntu in order to run deep face lab. Before we can run the face swap lab procedure on Ubuntu, we need to set up an environment that should include all the needed packages installed. Please note that it won't work on virtual machines. Let's get started. We will use deepfake hyperref github page, link at the description. Please navigate and click the Linux section. As you can see, it is quite straightforward procedure. We will perform it step by step as the instruction guiding. As you can see, we set a clean installation of Ubuntu machine with an internet connection. Let's navigate to the home directory and create a working folder named lab with capital letters. However, you can use any path you would like to. Let's start by installing the ffmpeg and the git packages. Please note that in this environment I don't have GPU. However, in your case, if you are using graphical card, please make sure that the drivers are up to date. Let's update the package list from the repository server by typing sudo app update, enter the password and let it do its things. Install ffmpeg by running the command sudo apt install ffmpeg enter and let it run type yes now let's install git package just type sudo apt install git press enter then yes and let it run Now let's navigate to the working folder path and continue to the next step. Let's download Anaconda. That is the recommended environment for this lab in order to avoid the mess of installing all the needed packages. In a nutshell, Anaconda is basically a multi-platform environment that contains many packages and shell one-stop shop for everything and easy to use. You can copy the link from the website and then run wget or download the file via the browser and copy it to the desired folder. After the package has been downloaded, make sure the file have executable rights and run it by typing bash space the file name and press enter. Scroll down and type yes, enter and let it run. Now type yes and enter to run the Anaconda process. Now let's close the terminal window and open it again in order to activate the Conda shell. You will see the word base in brackets. That's mean Anaconda is installed and activated. Let's navigate back to our walk-in folder path. Next step, we're gonna create Anaconda environment. Type in the command or copy paste from the page. Conda create minus N for the name of the environment. In our case, it's deep face lab. Then minus C, the criteria. Um, as you can see, we want Python etc etc and then press enter it will show you the list of the packages that are going to be installed press yes and uh, let it run it will download and install those packages okay now it's finished and the next step is to activate the environment we just created by running the command conda activated the name of the environment in our case it's deep face log and enter you can see the name in the brackets has changed to the name of the environment deep face lab okay now to the next step we need to clone the lab projects file from the git repository on github.com to our local machine by running the command git clone minus minus text one 
and the specific git file URLs. Uh, just copy and paste the URL and let it download the files as you can see on the screen. Next step, let's change directory to the new folder that has been created. You can see it contains the lab scripts folder and the readme file that includes the instructions. Now, while we in this folder, next step, let's clone and download the actual deepface lab folder and files by running the git clone command def minus minus one and the following git file URL. Now we are going to use the python and pip command in order to download and install the required packages in the list text file we cloned from the git server. Ok, let it run. It will take a while and when it finish, basically we can start to use the deepfake lab. Okay, now that we finish setting up the environment, basically now you can start to use the face swapping lab. However, there is an option to use free training models in our lab that should accelerate the artificial intelligence learning time and provide faster results. However, this is not mandatory and you can let your system learn everything from scratch. Let's give all the script files on the script for their executable permissions by running the command from the script directory sudo space ch mod space plus x and star and press enter now we are going to download pre-trained models let's run all the scripts files that start with the number 4.5 the first one is a pre-training of the source face ffhq will provide data set of high quality human faces google it for more info and some quick 96 pre-training models as well Let's run the script one by one. Well, that's it. Basically, now you can start the face swapping lab procedure by navigating to the script directory and begin using DeepFace Lab Linux. However, because it's a virtual machine, it won't work in my environment. I will stop here, set up a physical Ubuntu machine, and continue from where we stop at the next Power 2 video. Thank you very much for watching.